The Antonov AN-225 Mariah, a name that evokes awe in aviation fans across the globe. Meaning, dream, in Ukrainian, the Mariah was more than just an aircraft, it was a symbol of human engineering brilliance. And in 2025, that dream lives again. The world's largest cargo aircraft, reborn with modern technology, stronger materials, and more ambitious purpose. Welcome back to Mohamed Ayan, your destination for exploring the most powerful and legendary machines ever built. The story of the AN-225 starts back in the 1980s, when the Soviet Union needed an aircraft capable of transporting the Buran Space Shuttle and other oversized payloads. Antonov Design Bureau took on the challenge, and in 1988, the first and only AN-225 took flight. Its sheer size was staggering, six massive engines, a wingspan wider than a football field, and a maximum takeoff weight of over 640 tons. It shattered records and redefined what heavy lift aviation could achieve. For decades, the N-225 was a one-of-a-kind marvel, delivering everything from military vehicles to humanitarian aid across continents. It wasn't just an airplane, it was a global symbol of capability. But tragedy struck in 2022 when the aircraft was destroyed during conflict in Ukraine. Aviation enthusiasts around the world mourned the loss of an irreplaceable giant. Yet, that wasn't the end of Mariah's story. Fast forward to 2025, the dream has been rebuilt. Engineers at Antonov and Global Partners joined forces to reconstruct and modernize the AN-225. This new generation Mariah isn't just a replica of the past, it's a technological evolution. Using advanced composite materials, lighter alloys, and next-gen avionics, the 2025 AN-225 is stronger, more efficient, and more versatile than ever before. The new Mariah retains its original grandeur, the same six-engine layout, iconic high-mounted wings, and double vertical stabilizers, but under the surface, nearly everything has been upgraded. The engines are now high-bypass turbofans developed with improved thrust-to-weight ratios and fuel efficiency, reducing emissions and extending range. These engines enable the aircraft to carry payloads exceeding 300 tons while traveling over 15,000 kilometers non-stop, an incredible feat for a machine of its scale. Inside, the cockpit is fully digitalized, replacing the analog instruments of the original model with advanced glass displays fly-by-wire controls, and integrated AI-assisted flight management systems. This allows for safer handling, predictive maintenance, and smoother long-haul operations. The flight deck now requires fewer crew members, thanks to automation and improved sensor networks. One of the biggest achievements of the 2025 AN-225 is its expanded versatility. While the original was designed mainly for space components and heavy cargo, the new Mariah can perform a wider range of missions, from carrying large renewable energy parts like wind turbine blades, to humanitarian disaster relief operations where rapid deployment of massive supplies is critical. It's also compatible with modular cargo pods and even unmanned drone carriers, turning it into a flexible platform for both civil and defense use. Structurally, Antonov engineers reinforced the aircraft's central fuselage and landing gear system. With 32 wheels distributing its immense weight, the Mariah can land on rough or semi-prepared runways, making it suitable for remote missions where normal airports can't handle such giants. The loading system has also been redesigned. With automated cargo lifts, internal cranes, and digital load balancing systems, it can load even the heaviest freight in record time, minimizing turnaround between flights. In terms of avionics, the aircraft integrates global navigation systems, terrain awareness sensors, and satellite connectivity for real-time data transfer. Maintenance crews can now monitor each component remotely, predicting where and ensuring maximum uptime, crucial for such an expensive and complex aircraft. But beyond technology, the Mariah carries emotional weight. Its reconstruction was more than an engineering project, it became a symbol of resilience and unity. People from dozens of countries contributed funds, materials, and expertise. The N-225 isn't just Ukraine's pride, it's now a shared achievement of the global aviation community, reminding us that even in the face of destruction, innovation can rebuild dreams. In 2025, the reborn AN-225 took its first public flight, a spectacle watched live around the world. As the massive bird lifted off, engines roaring, millions of people cheered online. It wasn't just the return of an aircraft, 
It was the revival of human ambition. The sound of those six engines symbolized the rebirth of hope and progress. The Mariah's return also has commercial significance. With global logistics demanding faster, heavier, and more flexible transport, this aircraft fills a unique niche. No other plane can match its size or lifting capacity. Cargo operators, humanitarian agencies, and defense organizations all expressed interest in utilizing the aircraft's unparalleled abilities. Even space companies have considered using the AN-225 as an airborne launch platform for satellites, proving that this legendary aircraft still has a role in the future of aerospace. Yet, the 2025 Mariah is not without challenges. Its operational cost remains enormous, and only a few airports worldwide can accommodate its sheer dimensions. Maintenance requires specialized facilities, and the global shortage of spare parts for its unique design means it will always remain a rare and treasured machine. But for many, that rarity is exactly what makes it legendary. Every time the Mariah takes to the sky, it commands attention. Whether it's flying a record-breaking payload or delivering relief supplies after a natural disaster, its presence is unforgettable. Its graceful but powerful profile against the clouds inspires the same